it's Jenny Jan, the plant friend. I'm coming to you tonight. Um, actually, it is nighttime, so I'm getting a little extra light here. But I wanted to share with you guys a plant that I love dearly that is infested with mealybugs. And so this is my Anna, um, Monstera anisoniae thin leaf. And um, I was having a lot of trouble with this plant. It was um, a lot of yellowing leaves and I couldn't figure out what was going on with the plant. Didn't see any mealybugs at the time. And so a couple weeks went by and um, a lot of this going on in, with the plant. So a couple weeks went by and I just continued to check and it was infested. I don't know if it was laying its eggs at the time or what, but it's just been infested. So of course, um, I have my, um, my horticultural spray that I've used on it. I also have um, alcohol, rubbing alcohol, and I have um, Q-tips, and I am literally going through this plant um, here. And I have my little alcohol and my swab, and I'm going through this plant, and what I'm going to do is, um, it's gotten very leggy, so I'm going to be cutting it down and uh, I'm going to be propagating it and, you know, trying to salvage whatever I can with this plant. Um, but I wanted to let you guys see that not all of our plants are going to be um, healthy and without any problems that we will, we will run into problems from time to time. So, um, but I am just going to, just like that, I'm just going to cut it down and then I can thoroughly check each stem, each leaf, and make sure there's no mealybugs, no eggs, no larva, and I will spray it down again. Um, afterwards, I, I, I washed it down really good with water and, and then um, sprayed it with my other horticultural spray, uh, insecticide spray. And so now I am going to just, as I did before, I'm getting, see how leggy, there's no leaves on any of this. Um, just cutting it right at the node there and then I'll check this one thoroughly and each one I will um, if I see anything I will use the alcohol on it or even if I if I'm not even sure but I think it's something like there's some little white some spots here the thing about mealybugs is when you um, wipe them with alcohol the alcohol suffocates them and they turn brown like they die immediately um, which is a good thing, unfortunately. It is, because otherwise it's going to kill my plant. So, um, And you have to check really carefully. Like, there's one, and it's all tucked up in... See? They turn brown. Let me see where the camera... I don't know if you can see that brown dot there. But he was... There's a new leaf that was unfurling, and that mealybug had, had kind of curled its way up in to that, that leaf. So... Even though I'm taking the time to um, clean this off, if I didn't catch that one, and there's another one, um, then I would have just had the same problem all over again. So that's what we're doing here. So I will give you guys an update on this plant um, to let you know how it is doing. I'm going to propagate in water and then I will be transferring it to LECA. So like here again, very leggy, a few leaves here. So I'm just going to cut this in a couple different places and I will be propagating it. So I'll cut it there and then we'll check this one. And I don't know if that's something or not, but I'm just gonna wipe it just because it's white. Yeah, mealybugs are these, um, there's another one. Well, that one's dead, but okay. And afterwards, I'm gonna check these again. Even though I'm checking them now, I'm gonna check them and recheck them because it's a terrible thing to have an infestation of mealybugs. And I will um, disinfect all of my tools that I'm using when I'm done here. Um, so here we go again. 
another one. This is just, there's nothing there and it's a leaf unfurling, but it has a node there. So we'll propagate that in water. Didn't see anything on it. Um, this is all just, see, that's nothing. There's no leaf, so that's not gonna do anything. Okay, and so now we have this one and this one. Okay, so I am going to um, I am that's all I'm going to do with this guy tonight. I don't need this moss pole anymore, but I think I see a mealy bug on it. Isn't that something? Can't tell if that's what that was or not, but I'm going to spray it down really well and um see what else I can salvage off of this but again it's okay so I've cut off all of the ends that I'm gonna cut and this is what I have left I'm probably gonna leave this um, keep a close watch on it to see how it's going to do this is my propagated part of the plant and so hopefully when this is all said and done I'll have a nice full Anasanii Monstera Anasanii thin leaf plant again so thank you guys so much for joining me on this video. Again, this is Jenny Jen. Um, if you like it, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you have not already done so. Hit the notification button so that you can be notified whenever I upload content. And comment at the bottom if you have a comment because maybe you've had a plant that was infested with mealybugs and I wanna know what you guys did. Thank you so much. See you the next time. Bye-bye.